Okay, we have here an interesting integral from the UNSW integration. B2020, this was problem A1. We have the integral of x minus 1 over x plus x squared ln x dx. Okay, I found this one kind of tricky, and I actually did it quite a few different ways on paper. What I found was two pretty interesting methods. One is really quick, but less intuitive, and one's a little slower and more intuitive. So, so I think this may turn out to be two videos. I'm not really sure, but let's just do it the fast way right now. So the interesting thing I notice here is when you have x plus x squared, it makes me think we can factor out an x. Now when I did that and I factored out an x and divided into the numerator, it didn't work that great. It was still kind of messy, so I didn't really find a good way that way. But we could also factor out the x squared. So let's see what happens when we do that. So I'll just pull factor x squared out in the denominator. This will give me 1 over x for the first term, and the second term is just going to be natural log of x. But then what I want to do is just divide this into the numerator. So let's see what we have. Dividing into the x, we're going to have 1 over x here. And the second term is just going to be minus 1 over x squared. And then we'll have 1 over x plus ln x dx. But just with that one move, I think we're in good shape for a u substitution. I'm just going to make this whole denominator my u. So let's see how this goes. u is going to be 1 over x plus ln x. I'll take a derivative here. And we'll have du. This is going to be minus 1 over x squared. Derivative of ln x is 1 over x dx. But you'll notice now our numerator is exactly the du, just in a different order. So then we'll just go ahead and make this substitution. And so we'll have in the numerator du and the denominator just u. We integrate this, we get natural log absolute value of u. Back substitute the underhanded way. And for the final solution, we just have natural log absolute value 1 over x plus natural log x plus c, and that's it. So it's kind of a strange case where this becomes really quick and easy, but only if you get the first step. Okay, interesting problem. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a good day.